Mr. Wizard, I hate to say this, but your arithmetic isn't very good. What's the matter with it? Well, 1 plus 2 equals 3, that one's right. But 3 plus 3 equals 1, that's mm -hmm. not right. It is correct when you are dealing with cylinders like this and liquids. See, there's one unit down here, mm -hmm. okay? There's two units in here. Add them together. What do you get? Three, just like you said over there. Okay, now add three more. So okay. One, two, okay. three. Okay. Add them to these three. You think you should get six, right? Yeah. Okay, watch. It's going down? Yep. There's something strange going on behind this gray box. There think. certainly is something strange going on there. But now, first, I want you to see that my arithmetic is correct. There was three in the cylinder, and you added three. And where are we going to end up with, according to my arithmetic? One. And we now have two. Two. One and three quarters. One and a half. One and one half. One and one quarter. One. I was correct. There's, that's and you really were correct strange. also because there is something strange going on behind this box. Oh, you know I about siphons? There. Have you ever fooled around with no, siphons? I well, let me see if I can explain it by not using water, but instead using chain as a substitute for water. Okay? This is water in a mm -hmm. tube, and that's okay. water in a supply, like in that uh, cylinder. Okay. Once you get the siphon started, pull on that chain a little bit. That's enough. See what happens? Oh, it keeps going. Yes, it keeps going because the weight of the chain down here is enough to overcome the gravity pulling down on this one, right? The gravity okay. pulling down yeah. on here is greater than that. So that's what, gets it, that's what gets it started and what keeps it going. So what we have here is a self-starting siphon. Okay. So that means this doesn't need anybody to start it. Before. Anybody to get it started because well, what do you have? We had one plus one, okay, one plus two. So put two in there and then get rid of, oh, here, the other way. Pour two in there now. One. One plus two, what's that? Oh, this is, these are the same level. Yes, you see, it's at the same level. Now, the minute you go a little above that, you're going to start the siphon. And then it'll start flowing. Okay. Why doesn't it stop when it gets well, to Well, you'll see, pour it in there. You added three plus three equals one, right? There it started, there it goes. Okay, now, you can see why the pressure of the water here is greater. Yeah. See, so it's going down. Now when it gets here, this water flowing out of here is gonna pull that water over in effect, just like the chain. Okay. So that's why it continues. That's why it keeps going. And where is it gonna stop? At one. We're gonna just stop right there. So you see, my arithmetic was correct. 1 plus 2 equals 3, 3 plus 3 equals 1 when you're dealing with a self-starting siphon.